Hello Leo, welcome to your reading. Let's see what we have for you today. What do we have for the sign of Leo, please, regarding love? What's going on in the world of my Leo friends, my lions? What's going on in their world concerning love? You're showing up in your own reading here, Leo. Strength card, first card out. Change of circumstances. Ten of Pentacles. There's a decision here. Your present situation gives you a comfortable lifestyle. It gives you good work. Money's okay. It's stable. Mm, but you're faced with a decision. You, I feel there's an opportunity here, and you feel it's too good to miss. Mm. Some stress over somebody, or somebody stressing over the situation. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio energy, water energy. There's love involved here, but this person, or you, I feel, are not showing your emotions. Mm. Yeah, you've got a choice on not on ne not necessarily just with the person you want to be with, but choice of location here. Now with this, I feel there's an opportunity here to perhaps buy a a holiday home abroad. That's what I'm picking up for just one or two of you, and you you know it's. It's something you desired to live in another country, at least partly. Your job's well paid, but you know, for some of you, this is literally a move for work. You feel you've outgrown a certain situation, a certain job, and a, you you want to move on. I'm picking up you. You know, you brought up a family in the past. You've supported a lot of people. And it's, for some of you, it's time to think about yourself. There's a choice here. You've got the lovers, Gemini energy. Mm -hmm. So you've got water energy around you. You've got air energy around you. But there's something you're in two minds about. And there's a connection here that is out of reach at the moment you're doing a lot of thinking about this could be a distance and as i say living in another country for some of you there is a oh yeah going forward king of swords knight of wands yeah sudden impulse to travel Sudden desire to travel. You have been in a phase in your life where your mind is changed by, your perspective is being changed by the ever-changing situation. Uh, for some of you, this situation has been changing too quickly and you feel you can't keep up. But with this King of Swords here, I feel you'll be dealing with you know authoritative figures with regards to travel. But there's there's legal issues here of some kind. Mm, a lot of communication. Ooh, the devil. Yeah. There's a lot of talk going on, you know, about this move, but you feel pinned down, you feel trapped at the moment because there's a lot of delays. There's a lot of hiccups between you and getting what you desire, getting what you are wishing for, getting what, getting to we, be where you want to be. Perhaps the person you're dealing with is trying to tie some loose ends up or, or is in a situation that they feel they can't get out of very easily. And there could be a money factor here for some of you. 
But you have got a fresh start here. Like I say, and a huge desire to travel, the full card. It take a leap of faith. But you are being held back by circumstances outside of your control. Yeah, there's a... It could be the person you're dealing with is is not short of money. Is short of money and they're looking for some kind of support. There's somebody around you looking for some kind of support. And it's taking your attention a lot. Mm. There's a third party situation here. Five of Swords. It's causing conflict. Internal conflict. Like I say, there's a <clears throat> either you or the person you're dealing with is in a situation and there's delays on getting out. There's loose ends to be tied up on getting here. There is. But there will be an opportunity up here. Yeah. You've got Virgo energy here. The Hermit. New love offer. Ooh. Yeah, definite choices. For, I'm getting for a lot of you, it's a, it's a scenario where you're in a relationship, your work's good, you're in a good connection, it's a place you like to be. New love offer, but it's at a distance. I'm kind of getting going forward. You, you're willing to go see what develops. Go see this person. Go see the environment, because I'm getting a, I'm getting a heavy desire here to change the situation. Yes, yeah, it's, it's a choice between what you have and what you could have, but you want to hang on to what you've got because you've had to work hard for it and also there could be you know circumstances here holding you back and it's causing conflict you know children things like this I feel you're in a situation at the moment a lot of you which is very, very demanding on your attention and it's taking up a lot of your time. But there's feelings here developing for somebody else at a distance, not where you're at. Um, there's heavy contemplation on making a move. There's a lot of temptation here. Eight of Wands, that's also distance, it's travel. And very, very tempting offer an opportunity here. Just requires a leap of faith. Your scenarios will be very different. This is a general reading. Take what resonates. But in general, I'm getting here. You To get something new, you've got to give up something. And I feel a lot of you are not going to give this up because you've had to work too hard for it. You're comfortable money-wise. It's great. But this is causing you stress because there's a lot of desire here. So the conflict comes from the practical side of it, the money side of it, what you've achieved, what you've got, your house, your car, your job, a situation versus your feelings and your desires. Not an easy decision. I hope that's helped. But at the end of the day, I feel there is a decision you're going to have to make and an emotional one because there's some differences of opinion here as well because I feel some of you are dealing with a different culture. I'm going to leave it there. Thank you for watching.